Tina? Tina, it's Paul. Son of a bug, I popped a string. Are they gone? Oh, who are they? Oh, hey, stupid, don't stand out there talking at my crate. What if they come back? You want to give me away? Come on in here, it's neat. Police relatives, principals, lawyers, judges, mayors, governors, dentists, you, right. them, that's right. who. Simple matter of finding them and asking them. They're probably back at the depot by now. Or I could take you to them. You dumb, ugly, cockroach, Judas, snake, rat, spy, liar, think you just trying. You know what I'm going to do? What? I'm going to tell them you seduced me. But you've been dragging me along with you, and you can help me get away from him, and... I think you're out of your mind. That's right. I am. The experience has affected my sanity. My life is ruined. I know a similar case to mine where the fiend was given the electric chair because the fiend ran so high for the poor girl's unbalanced mental condition. Okay, I've had enough. Put your boot on. Come on. Oh! Put it on. You can take me to California where I'll become famous singing on records and recall you in all my interviews. Oh, is that Father it? Paul, mysterious and handsome, will help me on my road. That's it, huh? You want to go to California to become a singer? That's why you left your family? No family. And one of those men. Let's go find out. I'll start screaming right now at the top of my lungs. I'm sick of your act. Come on. You won't think it's no act. I'm only 15 and you hold me across the state line. All of a sudden, after those two old bats on the bus to California right now, remember they're my witness. They seen us lying side by side through the night, and they did not approve. Come on. Let's go. Help! Help! Oh, Paul, please take me to California. I will not assist or aid a juvenile running from the authorities. Now, you have a mother and father back there, and that's where you belong. I've got nothing behind me, nothing to go back to. I've got something up ahead if you just help me get there. I can't do it. You understand that? I can't afford to. You can't afford not to. Because, Paul, I swear, I'll make them believe me, and it doesn't matter whether they convict you or not. Just that you'll be in a lot of trouble that's going to hold you up for a while. Running man. You my enemy or my friend? I do almost anything to my enemy. I do anything for my friend. Now, what makes you think I won't call you bluff? Huh? I quote, you can't afford to. Huh. <laughs> Look, your little game can cost me a month of my life. That's exactly how long it'll take to prove you're a delinquent and a liar. It's okay. You tell me what you're up to. You tell me what you're headed from or to. Just give me some sort of answer. And if I can... I'll take you to California. I've already answered all those questions. Can we rent a car now? No. You were on your own before we met up, and you're on your own now. Goodbye, Tina. Okay, enemy, you're asking to see me at my best worst. You just better wait. Because if those men are there, I'm going to tell them my story. Just like I said, if they ain't, I'll follow after you wherever you go. And the first cop I see, boys, I'll point you out as my assaulter and start screaming my disturbed head off. And if you get away from me, I'll give them your name, Paul Bryan. And then they'll get you and haul you back to face up to my charge or statutory rape, and it ain't no joke. Please take me to California, please. Nobody's ever done anything I asked, anything I thought was good for me, but always making me do something they told me was good for me. What did I come out to be, a criminal or a liar? 
I believe where I'm going is good for me. Help me. And, and when I get there, Father Paul, I promise, rent a car and let's get started and I'll tell you everything you want to know. So help me. Amen. What have I done to deserve you, Tina? Blues. <laughs> 